This is the A45 AMG. What was once a family crossover weighing in at 3,200 pounds with 355 horsepower and 326 pound-feet of torque to the wheels is now 769 horsepower, 674 pound-feet of torque, and weighing 2,700 pounds. It is a drifting demon. In any old street circuit, this car can hold its own. It'll start in the back and creep its way up to the front, eventually winning the race for you. So to answer the short question, it can win races. But the point of this car isn't to be great in either direction. The point of this build is to have fun on asphalt and have fun off-road. With the all-wheel drive configuration, this build has good traction in corners on asphalt and doesn't spin out too much on the dirt. In the dirt, this car tends to shine well. The best way I would describe it is an ATV that you just have fun with. You can drive on the asphalt, keep speed, and you can drive on the dirt without any issues uh, due to the semi-slick combined with the all-wheel drive drivetrain. Now, I call this the drifting demon because sometimes when you're just playing with your friends, uh, you can effortlessly, dang, <laughs> you can effortlessly slide into drifts that, you know, keep you in the race, keep you up on pace with your friends and just have fun. Um, like I said, it's just a fun car. That's the whole point of the build. Configured in a rear wheel drive. There we go. <laughs> Uh, this car tends to slide out a little bit more on the dirt, um, which if you want to slide around and just fishtail everywhere, just change the drivetrain. Um, it's nothing, you know, too crazy, but you know, you can see that drift right there, how I just slide in, have, just slide, yeah. Now, overall, this car is nothing crazy special or anything like that. Um, it's really just kind of a fun build that I've done, uh, you know, out of a dream car, I guess. Not really. A, well, yeah, this is one of this is a realistic dream car, if that makes sense. Um, I currently have the GLA 250. Unfortunately, we can't get the A45 in any form uh, over in the US without importing it, um, which stinks because this is like a much cooler version of my car. My car airs on uh, a little bit of the mom car side, um, but spec'd out like this, it looks like the GLA 250, or the, yeah, the GLA 45 AMG, which is pretty much just this car with a slightly different rear end. Um, I think these were only, these were, uh, the GLA 250s were only introduced in about 2016, 2015 um, when I got mine. Uh, I don't know how long the A45 AMG has been around, um, but I assume that they'd unveil it as the same kind of deal, but for the UK or Europe. Um, yeah, I don't know. This car is just a really fun thing to drive around with you know just have fun um it's nothing like crazy top speed is about uh like the 170 range which is about realistic um because i know my car isn't getting over 160 uh with the 200 horsepower it puts out <laughs> Ooh, let's just go over here leroy <laughs> oh oh boy yeah, let's just reverse. But I currently have all wheel drive um, on this, which I believe the AMG A45 in real life is an all wheel uh, drive train because the A, um, well, if it's anything like Mercedes, it's counterpart will be the A450 um, or something like that. But or it might be the A250. Who knows? Uh, I'll have to research that. But 
if anything, it would be this should be all wheel drive in real life. It's even more fun with real rear wheel drive. God, I can never say that. Rear wheel drive enabled. Um, but all wheel drive, you get a little bit more control. You can just rip through these turns like this. And it's just, you know, something that's really fun to have around uh, in your garage. Um, I also have, you know, my little library that I made. Of course, I make all my custom libraries. Um, I currently have uh, my library enabled. Well, enabled, that's a weird way to put it. But my little custom library, I always make these. It's just fun to add my personality to the car. Um, doesn't do anything for the, uh, anything for the car itself, obviously. Um, but, you know, it just, yeah, it's a good way to add personality. The one thing I would change, uh, about this car is, well, really about the game is that, you know, after all the tunes and the engine uh, change and, you know, everything I added to it to get to this point uh, in the build, it kind of just sounds like a Volkswagen Golf. And, you know, I have nothing against those, but one of the things that always, you know, drives me to it, or draws me, sorry, one of the things <laughs> that draws me to the uh, AMG line is that deep, you know, Mercedes AMG uh, growl, which is, you know, going away now that they keep downsizing their engines every year. Also, speaking of just Mercedes and downsizing, can we talk about the uh, criminal act that is the new AMG GTR that will only have a two-cylinder hybrid? A two-cylinder hybrid in their top performing car? I'm sorry, I'm heated about that. But, yeah, this is just a fun car that you can take off. It's almost like an ATV. Uh, I've had a lot of experience, you know, driving, like, four-wheelers and stuff like that. And the way it translates into my head is it feels like one of those. Like, you know, throwing things around, um, not losing too much traction, but also not, like, glued to the ground so it's no fun. I don't know. It's just a fun car that if you want to mess around on Forza... Uh, then you can. And honestly, I'm here for all that because sometimes I get tired of races and I just want to drive around like an idiot. Like an idiot. <laughs> oh, why do they have animals in here? <laughs> but that's all I have time for today. I just wanted to do a quick showcase of my lovely little drift demon, as I like to call it. Um... <laughs> It's a very fun car, um, and I hope you guys got some entertainment value out of it. Uh, anyway, I'm Beanin. Uh, if you're new, you know, leave a like on the video. Let me know what you think about the car. Leave a comment, uh, and of course, subscribe. Um, I'm kind of restructuring my channel, so these videos come out just randomly whenever I have a fun little car worth sharing. Um, but other than that, thanks for watching. Peace.